Is beauty pain? No! Especially if you know our life hacks. If you don't have a lot of time, but a lot of friends, braid each other's hair. Rosie's hairstyle is very simple, but it looks great. Separate a strand of hair and twist it so you get a loop. Pull another strand of hair through it. Twist it into a loop the same way. Keep braiding towards the other side and fasten it with a bobby pin. It's elegant and very easy. And meanwhile, Stephanie is also working on her stylus skills. Part the hair and make two low ponytails. Separate the hair over the tie and pull the tail through the hole. Make a French braid out of the front strands. Slightly pull out some strands to add more volume to the braid. Wrap the ends of the braids around the ponytails. Does your hair block your vision so you can't see where you're going? Use a scarf as a hair accessory. Put your hair into a ponytail with a scarf. Make a braid and weave in the ends of the scarf. And tie it off to finish the braid. Your hair goes from messy to fabulous in just one minute. Cindy has a whole collection of bobby pins. She wants to pull off a nice hairstyle. But something goes wrong. Her bobby pins conspired against her. Cindy is ready to take extreme measures. But Lucy comes just in time. Leave the scissors alone and use a simple trick. Comb your hair to the side. Fasten the strands near the temple with bobby pins. Attach a whole row of colorful bobby pins. This hairstyle is great for short hair too. Cindy's hairdo and mood got better right away. Don't have a hair tie nearby? But you do have a rubber glove? Take the thick ring off a rubber glove. Use it instead of a hair tie. Now your hair won't get in the way of your art. A regular pencil can help you control your unruly hair. Twist your hair into a knot at the back. And stick in a pencil to fasten it. You can also use a pen or a brush. My hair needs something special. Pearls might help me. I'll copy a hairstyle I saw on Instagram. Tie a ponytail on the side. Wrap a string of pearls around the hair tie. Start making a braid out of two strands and the pearls. Gradually braid in thin strands from the ponytail. Turn the braid and go down the ponytail so that the string of pearls is always on the edge of the braid. Wrap it around the ponytail a few times. Fasten the ponytail with a hair tie. Decorate it with a string of pearls. Cut off the excess. And your hair is done! Wow! How beautiful! Will you help me come up with something interesting? Of course! Put the front strands into a ponytail. Divide it in half. Braid each part by gradually adding in strands from the same side. Repeat for the other side. Put the braids together at the bottom and fasten them with a hair tie. That was fast and it looks so neat! Thank you, Rosie! Lipstick and messy hair are match made where the devil lives. But I don't want to do my hair just to make my lipstick look better. Rosie has an idea. Leave the front strands free. Put the rest of the hair into a low ponytail. 
Put the front strands into a ponytail too and twist it over the hair tie twice. Then pass the bottom ponytail over the upper strands and undo your hair. Awesome! Now my hair won't stick to my lips. How much does getting my hair dyed cost at a salon? What? I could buy a pony with that much money. I'll do it myself. I just need a lot of paper. Cut rolls of colored crepe paper into strips. Cover every color with hot water in separate containers. Put the top strands of your hair you want to dye into a ponytail and dip the ends of the ponytail into the lightest color from the palette. Keep your hair in it for a few minutes. Take it out and blot it with a paper towel. Dye the bottom strands the same way using darker shades. Soak them in the colored liquid and pat it dry with a paper towel. Blow dry your hair. Dyeing your hair can be colorful and cheap. This looks just as good as if I'd gone to a salon. Braids with rings are super trendy this season. But making small braids takes so much time. My arms hurt! Thank goodness I've got detachable braids. Braid a hair extension. Gradually, braid in small rings from top to bottom. Fasten the braid with a clear hair tie. Attach the extension closer to the part. A pre-made braid extension saves time and effort. Stylish hair is pretty simple. Do you want something effortless and creative? A scarf will do the trick. We've got three options for you. Here's option one, twist the scarf. Wrap it around your head and tie it at the top. Hide the ends under the scarf. Take out the front strands. The second option, place the rolled scarf on top of your head. Twist it around at the base of your neck under your hair. Use the ends of the scarf to make a ponytail. The third option, put your hair into a low bun. Tie the scarf around your head like this. Tie the ends of the scarf around the bun. Take out a few locks at the front. Rosie is waiting for nice curls, but her curlers failed the task. What about a curling iron? It's still not working. But a flat iron never lets you down. Place a lock of hair into a flat iron and press it. Twist the iron at 45 degrees, taking turns with the sides. Voila! A soft movie star wave is all done! It's so windy! Our elegant bow hair tie will help you be stylish even when there's a tornado outside. We'll need two feet of wide velvet ribbon. Cut off a piece. Fold it and fasten it in the middle with gel glue. Fold and glue a piece into a thin strip. Attach a matching hair tie to the base. Add a long piece of the ribbon as the ends of the bow and tie the pieces in the middle with the glued strip to shape a bow. Cut the ends of the ribbon at an angle. Take the front strands of hair and tie them at the back with the bow. Windy weather 
isn't an issue for me. Did you like our hair ideas? Let us know in the comments about how you do your hair. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so that you don't miss new beauty tricks from Troom Troom.